Each year, we welcome back a former ITV student. Tonight, we introduce Mr. Caleb Bish, a former student of George Jenkins High School with Mr. Jensen, Lakeland Hyards, Lakeland Hyards Middle with Ms. Farrell, and Scott Lake with Mr. Bennett. He received his bachelor's degree in communications with a concentration in marketing from Warner University. After many jobs with video editing and directing, Mr. Bish and his wife Jennifer launched Storybox Creative. Their production company is dedicated to helping businesses tell their story through high quality video productions. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Caleb Bish. Thank you. It's great to be back here. It's hard to believe it's been about 11 years since the last time I was here as a senior in high school. Uh, people ask me how long I've been doing video production and I tell them almost 20 years, which usually receives a pretty blank stare as they find out that I'm actually 20 years old. Um, <laughs> And, but what they don't know is that I started when I was in fifth grade at Scott Lake Elementary in Polk County Schools. And while that doesn't technically qualify as professional work experience, uh, I hold the training and education that I received at Polk County Schools in very high regard. Though biased, I've always said that this is one of the top programs in the entire nation. In fact, whenever I was in high school, we started entering our work into national contests, and we found those much easier to win than the awards that will be given out here tonight because of the high standard that's been set in Polk County. So it's exciting to be back, and I'm looking forward to watching some of the creative work that the students are doing. Um, and I won't talk long, but I do want to say a few things to a few different groups of people that are here. The first is to the ITV staff. Thank you. Thank you for uh, all the work that goes into a night like tonight. Uh, as you get a little older and your perspective changes, you realize that nights like tonight don't happen. They're not easy to pull off. Um, and it involves a team of people putting a lot of work into it, and I think it's important that from the beginning we show them our appreciation for all their work. The second, no, the second is to the teachers in the room. I had three teachers during my time at, in video production, Mr. Bennett, Mrs. Farrell, and Mr. Jansen. And though it's been over a decade since I've talked to any of them, I still think about them very often. You're laying a foundation in your students' lives that will last long after your time with them is over. And although the extra work involved in preparing your team for a night like tonight is extreme, uh, I hope that that encourages you a little bit. And the third person I want to talk to is the parents in the room. Uh, I was fortunate to have parents who believed in me and supported my dreams and took me very seriously from an early age. Uh, the video awards were a family affair in my household. Parents, grandparents, aunts and uncles, siblings, everybody came here. Trust me when I tell you that your support means the world to your children. And finally, I want to talk to the students in the room. As I've said, you're very fortunate to have a program like this. Video production is a diverse and exciting field, and I have classmates that are working for news stations, production companies, and create creative agencies all over the world or country, I don't think I have anybody in the world. Uh, but uh, it's allowed me personally to travel around the country and internationally, and for about a year and a half, it allowed, has allowed my wife and I to start our own small business right here in downtown Lakeland. So I encourage you as students, work hard, find internships, ask lots of questions. Uh, some days, just take a camera and go shoot something. Uh, I promise you, if you keep looking for ways to make yourself better, this will take you amazing places. Thank you and good luck.